In Sierra Leone's capital city of Freetown, rush hours are just like any other major city across the world. Lengthy traffic jams see a long line of minibuses, mopeds, shared taxis and three-wheeled vehicles known as KKs, each spluttering toxic emissions into the air. Each year, about 4.2 million people die prematurely due to outdoor air pollution, with low- and middle-income countries overwhelmingly facing the impact. One such person was James Samba's uncle. His death spurred the 23-year-old Samba to develop his own model of an electric KK that could help clean up Sierra Leone's pollution. Samba has set up his own company called Sierra Electric, which manufactures solar-powered KKs and disability-friendly electric vehicles. However, a lack of funds made him partner with a startup, Neve Salon, to develop a KK powered by rooftop solar panels. James Samba believes that solar KKs are cheaper to run as the drivers face lower maintenance costs. Some drivers have already converted to eco-friendly options amid rising fuel prices.